Hey, what's up, Sewing Squad? Real quick before the video, I just want to say thank you. Thank you to everybody who's donated so far. I, it really means a lot to me. And a very big special thank you to Tifa Chu13, who actually bought all of the audio equipment that I had on my Amazon wishlist at that time. Uh, that was a huge help, and I wish so desperately that I could have thanked you with the usage of the audio equipment, but I actually haven't learned how to use it yet. And I didn't want to deprive anyone of Common Artist Couch for too terribly long. So uh, we'll, we'll get that going hopefully before the next video. Uh, if you haven't donated yet, but want to, don't worry. There's Still plenty of time we uh we there's still a couple other things that we need namely video equipment because you know we're we're kind of still struggling but uh, i have that link in the description for the book <laughs> you know the link is in the description below for that <laughs> and hopefully also i will be able to put things up in the wish list um but thank you so much it really means a lot to me that you guys actually like my content this much and i'm so happy and grateful that i can be able to give this to you and so without further ado here's our next video would you, would you like to do the intro with me? What is the intro? The intro. Hello, welcome to Common Arts Couch. Would you, would you? Okay. Are you ready? Three, two, one. Hello, and welcome to Common Arts Couch. Today we have my wonderful friend, Tokoyami, here to answer all of your dark and brooding questions, because they have to be dark and brooding. I know they had to, otherwise you wouldn't have come. Are you ready? Are you ready? Get on with it. Okay, okay. So, my first truth for you. Have you ever played chess with Dark Shadow? Once. And it was actually going very well. He was a very good chess player, and then he got frustrated and ate all the pieces. We stopped playing board games after that. Uh, okay, this isn't a truth, but he ate the pieces? Yes. Where did they go? Do you have chess pieces in your stomach now? Did you have to pass those? How- are you okay? Unfortunately, we do not know where things go when Dark Shadow eats them. It is something that keeps me up at night. Oh, <laughs> Okay, I don't want to know either. Um, so... How about instead, I I ask you to do a dare. Are you ready for a dare? Sure. Can you please give us your best bird call? You knew this question was coming. I did. I did, but I was hoping that you were better. No, I'm not. I was hoping you had a little bit more journalistic integrity. Please, for the clout. For the clout and all of the good people at home. <laughs> okay. That's your best. I'm not gonna fight you on it. Just because I have a bird head doesn't mean I can speak bird. Why? Why not? Do you not have a bird throat? Obviously not, since I'm speaking to you. Okay. Unless I've secretly been speaking bird this whole time and no one told me. Um, okay, whatever. It doesn't matter. Screw the- screw the caca business. I have another truth for you. Who's your favorite pro hero? Since this is going on YouTube, obviously I have to say Hawks. Okay. Because... He lives on social media, he will find it, and he will be insulted if I do not. But didn't you just kind of secretly admit that, like, you were forced to say hawks? Who would the answer have been if you weren't forced to say hawks? Just between, you know, you, you and me. I'll totally edit this part out, I promise. <laughs> I won't, but you should tell me anyway. I'm just gonna stick with hawks. Oh. Plausible deniability. Okay. You're a coward, but whatever. Uh, follow-up truth, what was it like interning with Hawks? You know, knowing that I'm totally gonna edit this part out and that it's totally gonna be safe. Be truthful. Interning with Hawks is... a little like babysitting a hyperactive child. He wants to do everything, he wants to do everything, and he wants to do it all at once, and then he's racing around, and he's like halfway across fucking Japan at some point, and then I'm just left behind with Dark Shadow trying to fly. 
How's that been going for you? Not well. Damn. Honestly though, that sounds a lot like me before I got my my medication. My Zyrtec. Do you want to let him borrow some? It would probably be good for all of us. The only problem is the fact that if he takes some of mine, then that means less for me, and you would have to deal with Actually, that. Yeah, no, keep it. Just, just keep that. We got it sorted. We got it sorted. Uh, moving on. I have a dare. Can you cast a spell on me? Preferably one for good grades. But you know, I'm not picky. Just want to feel that magic. I would, but that would be unethical. Why? And I'm a hero. Why would it be unethical? Because I said so. <laughs> Listen, buddy, okay? Considering the fact that we have Miss Beautiful Hair Know It All, Miss Pretty Boy Know It All, Miss Spike Mr. Spiky Boy, I don't do anything other than study, and the ultimate nerd himself, I think that it would be totally ethical. It would just be giving putting me on the same playing field with the other people in our class, you know where you deserve to be. Or we could just study together. You would study with me? Oh, I did just say that, didn't I? <gasps> yeah, you did. You would study with me? Yes. Yay! Yes. You're not gonna do my hand thingy, okay? <gasps> yes! Okay, now that the contract has been sealed, it was magic in its own way, the magic of friendship. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so true, a truth for you. Um, have you ever thought of being a villain? Well, or, uh, okay, let me rephrase the question, because I realize that that's kind of nickname. Um, have you ever considered villain aesthetic? Would you dress like a villain? Well, being a villain and dressing like a villain are two very different things. Yeah, I'm just dumb. Is this your, your villain Sona outfit? <laughs> Is that not a normal thing? Do you not have a villain Sona? So every once in a while, I feel like I have to balance it out with, you know, a little love, a little, a little appreciation for the Zappy Zap Man. Um, now that we got that dare out of the way, back to the truths. Uh, do you ever feel like people are racist towards you for being birdkin? <laughs> this is important. I'm sorry, I just, I, I need a moment to process. What just came out of your mouth? I'll say it again Please if that'll don't. help. No, 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 no. Uh, a bird can. Does this count? Does this count as being racist against me because of my appearance? Maybe. But that doesn't answer the question. The answer to your question is yes! Oh, okay, cool. Oh, uh, uh, moving right along. More questions about you being a bird. Um, except I formulated this question to be like a dare so it would balance out a little bit better. Uh, will you please, I dare you, I dare you to show me the secrets of your family. 
Do you, did your mom fuck a bird? I'm not sure. What? <laughs> My father insists that he found me as an egg while doing his job. What's his job? He works as a park ranger. So this man just found an egg and was like, what is this? I don't know, it could be empty, it could be a dinosaur, a Jurassic Park happens now, and instead a whole 90% of a man popped out of that egg. I mean, he wasn't too terribly shocked. He himself is mostly bird. I have the 90% man with bird head, he has the 90% bird with vaguely human proportions deal going on? So your dad is a furry. Is, are we done now? Can I leave? No, okay. We're, no, please. Wait, no. I'm almost done. You can't leave when we only have, like, one, one dare left. I'll make it quick. I promise. You just, no. I, yeah, hold on. I have to, uh, grab something for this. Um, uh, okay, here we go. Because, you see, our lovely fans at home, shit, I don't have arms. Uh, uh, fuck. Oh, I mean, frick, this is a family-friendly show. Shit. Oh, I have containers. So smart. Hold on. So basically, this is Chubby Bunny, but I don't have marshmallows, and also your beak is really big. Is this mandatory for releasing me? Yes. As soon as as soon as you complete this challenge, you're free to go, little something. I'm sorry, I'm racist. <laughs> One. Two. social distancing. Don't do drugs. <laughs> Buy our shit! Buy my- join my Patreon, or don't. I don't control you.